Day two. Good morning. First stop is in Garni Temple. Garni Temple, yeah, no? Pagan Temple. And in the 14th century, he mentioned about Garni, saying that there was a temple in 2166 BC here in this place. Uh, and in the first century, it was destroyed by a Roman general Corbulon. Um, Mukasang. Roman, Greek Roman structure. Just appreciate. Ang ganda ng view sa likod. Tapos ang ganda ng temple. This gets crowded pretty fast. 9:40. So we're, we're a bit late. Late na kasi marami ng tao. Second stop is another church slash monastery. The name is Mayrap say pronounce Gehad. Gehad. Okay, sabi nila, you need to throw pebbles dun sa yan yung mga yan. And if you put three pebbles dun sa tatlo, you get. To make a wish that will come true. Pretty BS. Oh, today is a weekend. Kaya maraming tao. And consistent with what I've been saying the whole time. This monastery is inside this, I don't know, valley but Are we in a valley? I don't know. They're explaining about the pagan symbols that remains in the church. And then there's this healing water in the area. At some point, there was an earthquake and this church or this monastery was saved. This is what's inside the cave. Let me be a bit talkative. So Armenia, we've come to realize, is a country that is really steep in religion. So everything na pinuntahan namin is either related to pagan temples or more recently, Christian churches. Um, sinasabi ng guide namin palagi parang Catholic, but it's not the Roman Catholic Church that is dominant in this country. Third stop is the Chakador Ropeway. It's a ski resort if you want to hit the slopes. So, sasakay ka ng one of five ropeways dito. And we're pretty high up. Hi! My music pa. I'm walking away. Look. It's a 15 minute ride. Lapit na. Yes. Kamusta? Do you think sobra yung itinerary natin for two days? Arang ang dami natin kinover. Eh. Sakto. Sakto lang for two days. Sa Sakto? Nakakapagod kaya tong trip na to? No, yung first day was Walang break. Yung first day. I think itong second day medyo relax. Hmm. Usually... Four, four places. I disagree. Usually two-two lang eh. Pero yun nga. Yun nga. <laughs> ice cream. Uh, I know ice cream yet. Yeah. <laughs> ice cream. Very good, babe. So far, so good. Last stop for day two Lake Sevan. Hello, my bestie. <laughs> this is the last stop for the day. Um, we will probably end our Armenia trip to Saverni Saj, which is their open air market. You'll find a lot of handicrafts, jewelry. Um, 
souvenirs and whatnot. Si Irwin nakabili siya ng ano, Beatles na vinyl, Hard Day's Night na album ng Beatles na parang Russian version, yung cover. So, this will conclude our two-day trip in Armenia. It's quite possible na matur mo yung Armenia in two days. There are things to see and places to go. Kung kulang ka sa leave, kaya mo ng two days in and out from Dubai. Weekend in Armenia. Walang absent. And the thing is, Armenia is not really an expensive place to go to. Mura ang pagkain, mura ang bilihin. If you know how to talk to the taxi drivers at hindi mas ka, mura din ang transportation. Like Yerevan is a very walkable city. Um, hindi kami nag-public transportation except when we're going out of town. So, madali lang siyang lakaran. Ang natitira na lang is um, dinner. And then at 10 p.m. susunduin kami. Um, and then we'll head back. Great two days. Very fun. All good. So remember, if you have the time, capabilities, punta ka na Armenia.